They say fame don't change you. Yeah, right. It changes everybody, including your friends. People you thought were your best friends, suddenly you don't know who they are anymore. And then you wonder, can you ever trust them again? It all started one Saturday night. We were chilling outside of Gladys's nightclub, waiting on Tahir to come back from inside. He was trying to push off his demo on some producer. My girl Denise was looking fine. She the type of girl every man wants, but only I can have, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, we fuss a lot, but it's all good. As for Lydia and Tahir, opposites must attract. I mean, he's all into his music and thinks the whole world revolves around him. I hate to say it, but I know my boy. We've been hanging for a long time, and he's a player. But Lydia, his shorty's real shy, and all into Tahir. Corey, on the other hand, can't get no play. But he's all right. He gives me something to laugh at. Oh, what's up, man? What's up, man? What's up, man? What's so funny, yo? That Denise's house is so nasty, they roaches going around wearing footies. At least my daddy don't send me to school with black eyes. You gotta go there. Y'all chill with that for a minute, man. Yo, yo, man, what I tell you about leaning up all on my piece, man? Come on, Duke. <sighs> Skip Martin. Oh, yeah. Bob Rankins. Yeah. You the guy who signed Brandy. Yeah, that's me. Well, uh, Tahir ain't Brandy. Tahir, I'm glad I called you. I had a DJ play your tape. Yeah. Oh, all that. Look, give me a call tomorrow at the hotel. All right. All right. All right. All right. Yeah, yeah. All right. All right. All right. All right. Hey, yo, Skip. You got a comedy division. Uh, after that night, things you, went straight to the curb. Like, and Lydia, she was having the hardest time of all. Not stupid. I know that when he gets his contract, there are going to be a lot of girls. I mean, look around us. Most of these girls in the school can't even spell no. Look. If you can't keep a man with your mind, you don't need him. I know. Just stick to your guns. <laughs> if you ain't ready to do nothing, don't. He can wait. Trust me, the only thing worse than making a mistake is having to live with one. Denise, why can't things just stay the way they are? Who needs to be famous when they're in high school? Tahir does, girl, you tripping. Lydia, what's wrong with you? What? I think I'm pregnant, Denise. What? Denise, you gotta swear you won't tell nobody. I mean, anybody. Okay, I swear, but you and Tahir, I thought you don't... We did. Just once. in his room. Denise, I thought I was losing him. Does Tahir know? No. So I wrote him a letter. I don't even know if he read it yet. But guess who did read it? That reigning terror Tahir lives with, Aunt Joyce. She's strict on Tahir, and for some reason, she never liked Lydia. Is this true? I've tried, I've tried talking to you. But you all act like you know everything. Did you think Tahir was going to marry you? Is that it? I want you to tell me how two kids are going to raise a baby when they can't even take care of themselves. Lydia, what were you thinking? What are you going to do with a baby? Especially if something happens to Tahir. Well... Don't worry about it. I'll take care of the situation. Oh, yeah, I'm sure. How? By getting rid of it? How old are you? Sixteen. My sister was fifteen when she had to hear. Fifteen years old. She had her whole life ahead of her, just like you. She made a mistake just like you. Her friends were trying to tell her to get rid of it like it was no big thing. But I told her what a special baby he was going to be. And I wasn't wrong. I 
didn't say anything about an abortion. I just don't know right but now. But Lydia, I do. Lydia, you are a bright and beautiful young lady. You've got your whole future ahead of you, and that baby is going to need you to keep it together and be an example. You can't afford any more foolish mistakes, young lady. Do you understand me? Yes, ma'am. That day, we all found out that Nasty Aunt Joyce did have a heart. Tahir, meanwhile, was off partying, celebrating his new record deal, leaving Lydia all alone. I can give you everything he can. I mean, if you're not hung up on looks, money, muscles, the only difference is I would never put you in this situation. You know what? He's not even the only one of us that's going to be famous. I'm next. I know you will, Corey. I just don't understand. Right now, I just need to be alone. Yo, Corey shouldn't have done that. Trying to push up on Lydia and supposed to be to his boy? He sent himself up to get his behind kicked. Man, I was glad me and Denise had it straight. She was the only girl I wanted to be with, and I thought she felt the same way about me. Only one I'm worried about getting into something she shouldn't be in is my little sister. Her fast behind's gonna get her in trouble. Hey, hold on. You are getting too fast, little girl. I see hanging out with Sean ain't the answer after all. Well, well, well. If it ain't the hoe, pulling the shovel's dirty. And we all have our little secrets. Trick, trap. Are you all right? I hate boys. Look, I don't mean to act like I'm your father. I just want him to respect my sister. Yeah, like you respect Denise. That's different. Why? She's somebody's sister, too. We're older. And plus, that's my girl. Is she? She told you I was here, didn't she? She tells everybody's business. Well, did she tell you about her and your so-called best friend? No, she didn't tell me. But I was she's about to She's lying on out. me! She said she saw you! Why is Nikki gonna lie? You know your sister don't like me. Hold up. Tahir called me up and asked me can he borrow my Jodeci tape so he could bump and grind with some girl at the movie theater. I called your house and your sister told me you went to the movie. She lying too? I told her to say that because... Denise! I didn't even talk to your sister. What's up, Denise? Why? I, I don't know. Why? Just because, Marcus. He's gonna be famous. I just wanted to be a part of that, even if it was only But with my night. best friend? You and him had no respect for me. No, you and him had no respect for me. You told him everything we did. You touched me right in front of him. The two of you sing songs that call women all types of names. I never meant to hurt you. That's all you have to say. No. I'm sorry. I promise, if you forgive me, I swear, I'll never do it again. I don't know. I need some time. But I do know I better not ever see him again. I can see her doing something like that. Damn, he was like blood, man. What you mean, was? Yo, that probably has nothing to do with Tahir. I have no love for him, man. I know what you mean. It seemed like Tahir get everything, and we get nothing. Yeah, I always knew you kind of jealous of Tahir. Nobody tell us I have nothing. What you doing, man? What's up? What's up? Yo! Yeah, yeah. What is going on in here? Oh, Marcus? I, I was just tripping, T. Sit down. Have a seat. 
Everyone take their seats, please. I have some disturbing news. Ron and Tahir were just involved in a serious accident. They're badly hurt. That's all we know for now. Everything was whack. It was like the family just split up, you know what I'm saying? Everyone for themselves. Sometimes I feel like I just want things to be the way they used to be. And then I think about it. I ain't trying to go back. From now on, my trust ain't coming so easy. And my friends, well, next time I'll be careful who I call my friends. They say it takes time, you know, to get over things. Well, that's good, because time, I got. Searching for a new high, looking in the wrong places, deceived by smiling faces. I got that thing you've been peeping. Come get a fix, knowledge be the key from your misery. Come follow me as I take you on a mission to a place where you are so controlling in position. Make that transition from the neg to the pause. Understand the ones before you died for the cause. Times to make you uptight, ride, but we don't pay the time. No, never mind, a clever mind. Stays focused on the truth, ain't that right, boo? Should've known by now that the future is you. Grab a hold of your inner soul, reach for your goals, be bold in your venture. The main man sent you gifts to uplift your own. Let it be known, another proud black butterfly has flown. Black butterfly, fly, 